congratulations, Greg West. I'm so excited to do your awards this year. You are just so passionate and caring and giving and you're always willing to help others. You represent the culture of Edward Jones. I just want to say what a phenomenal year you had in 2020. You moved from level seven to level eight, earned the AF McKenzie Award, grossed over 630,000, had an weekly serve of 76%, CEI of 428, you had two best months ever, and you hit your first net 20K month. So what an amazing year. Thank you for all you do to give back and to help and to care for others. Congratulations. This next award goes to my good friend, Cleve Grissom, the AF McKenzie Award, with gross commissions of over $668,000 this year. It increased gross commissions of over 116,000, with an uh, AUC of 145 million. Congrats to you, Cleve. Uh, you do a lot in the region uh, and do a lot for your branch. Uh, you've done a good night completion as well as field trainer for Kenyon. 10% uh, increase in deep reserve. I won't say too much about that. A 424 CDI. Uh, you run an amazing branch. All this money you've made, I can't understand why you don't buy any lunch more. But uh, congratulations, buddy. You deserve it. The AF McKenzie Award. All right. The next person I'd like to recognize uh, is I just took a poll and found out the greatest BOA in the region. Sorry to all the other BOAs, but uh, the award is for my BOA, Nicola Wells. Uh, wouldn't be here without you. Um, she, over the last year, was part of the BOA support team. She won the Jack Phelan Award, Solution System Advocate, Top 25% CSI, as well as 76% Deeply Served. Uh, must have a, an amazing branch there. Uh, congratulations, and what a year it's been. We want to take a minute to celebrate and congratulate the South African Queen, Tilly Brand. Tilly, hey, thank Adam. you. Yes. You're talking about Tilly? That's the video that we're taking is about Tilly. Tilly Brand. Tilly Brand. Did you tell them about the food yet? We'll get to the food in a minute. Tilly, thank you for what you've done and how hard you've worked that our office qualified for the AF McKenzie Award. And that's because of you and hey, all the Adam. hard work. Yes. Mm, still talking about Tilly? Still the same video that we started 30 seconds ago. Our Tilly Brand. Tilly Brand. Okay, did you tell them about the food We yet? can talk about the food in a minute. Go ahead and tell them about what she's done for your branch. Tilly, thank you very much for the love and support that you've given me as a new FA. I wouldn't be where I am today and have been be as successful as I am without your support. Yeah, and Tilly, because of you, we have a deeply served of over 72%. Thank you so much for that. Hey, Adam. Yes. Still talking about Tilly? Same video. Tilly Brand. That South African and Queen, yes. Okay. Did you tell them about the food yet? I'll tell them now. Tilly makes us lunch all the time. It's amazing. It's good. It's South African treats, and we're so thankful. Tilly, thank you for letting us be your boys. Tilly, thank you. We love you. Thank you. Thank you. Tilly Brand, the South African Queen. Hi, my name is Kenyon Lockery, and I'm here to celebrate a real stellar individual, one of the greatest financial advisors in our region, no doubt. Winner of the Jack Phelan Award, over half a million dollars of gross commissions, over 9.3 net new assets in 2020, 70%, 76% deeply served, Edward Jones Service Award 15 years with the firm, top 25% CEI score of 439, and he's a field trainer. I know he's a field trainer because he was one of the first guys I ever met in the interviewing process. And he's always looked out for me and he, I think the world of him. It's a gentleman by the name of Rob Rosen. Congratulations, sir. Hey, Rena. I just want to say thank you for all that you've done for Edward Jones, what you've done for this branch, what you've done for me. Uh, you're an amazing BOA. 2020 was a great year for us. We had the Jack Phelan Award for over 475,000 in gross commissions. We have a deeply served score of 89%. Our CEI in the last 12 months, our best score was 464. Just some amazing numbers, and so much of that is because of you. You're a great BOA. Thanks for what you do as the mentoring coordinator for the region. Uh, the Pet of the Year contest was a success, and that was sparked by you. 
And um, again, you've done so much for our clients, for Edward Jones, for the branch, and for me. So thank you very much. Hello, Rena. Sean and I both just want to say what a great BOA you are. And I tell you, it's been amazing. I'm so blessed to have the best BOA in Edward Jones. Um, she's my BOA. What? Yeah. No. She's mine. No, she's my BOA, Sean. No. 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 Well, maybe today she's your BOA, but let's talk about the future. Well, she's fine. Yeah. Mm-hmm. What are you uh, trying to say? I'll let you I'll let you go on thinking, man. Uh uh-huh. no. She's my BOA. Rena, you're awesome. You're my BOA. Yeah. And you are awesome. We'll see how that goes. Yeah. <laughs> So I'd like to talk briefly about our most tenured FA in our region. Um, he, the year he, he was hired with our firm, Another Day in Paradise was the number one song in the country, and that's by Phil Collins. A lot of you are saying who? Um, George Herbert Walker Bush was named our 40th president. The Miami Hurricanes were the NCAA college football national champions, and CNBC was launched. Um, this last year, uh, he was the recipient of the Frank Finnegan Achievement Award with gross commissions of $460,751. And he has a Good Night Completion Award with Sean McClure. Ladies and gentlemen, let's congratulate Shane Nelson. Hi, my name is James Fobert and I have the honor to recognize my senior BOA, Linda McManning. Here are Linda's 2020 accomplishments. She will be receiving the Edward Jones Service Award for 10 years. Top 25% customer service excellence, a CEI score of 437, 83% deeply serving our clients. She'll also be receiving the AF McKenzie Award, Managing Client Relationships, that resulted in exceeding $625,000 in gross commissions. Most importantly, I want to say thank you for all that you do. Congratulations. Today, we are recognizing Ed Burnside for 15 years of service at Edward Jones. Ed ranks in the top 25% with his CEI score of 443, a 44 point increase, as well as $11,278,323 in new assets in 2020. Ed is receiving the Frank Finnegan Achievement Award with $431,000. $921 $921 in gross commissions. And then she went to the office administrator and she also worked in the estate department. She worked as an office administrator with two firms and now she's with Edward Jones. She's been with Edward Jones for 12 years, and I have been with Mary for eight of those 12 years. Jones taught me what they needed to show me to build a business, but Mary, you've taught me the intricacies of the business, and you've taught me a wealth of knowledge that cannot be learned from anyone else. I cannot do this job without you, nor would I ever want to find out. Thank you for being my support network and my teammate. Thank you, Mary. Okay, guys, so the official results are in. The region's best BOA goes to Liz Steffen. Congratulations, Liz. Very good accomplishment. And of course, the second award, straight from Penny Pennington's desk, of course, the most handsome financial advisor in Region 316. Let's have a look here. Todd Bodiford, wow, congratulations. And of course, second place being Ryan Conley. Sorry, Ryan, try better next year, of course. Uh, Seriously though, um, this video is about Liz. Um, She's a phenomenal BOA. Um, She's winning the Spirit of Partnership Award She's a senior BOA with 10 years of experience. This last year, she's been a BOA for three different financial advisors, either directly or indirectly. Um, She has 77% deeply served, 90% multiple goals, 100% financial foundation star. 
She's done this by being profitable and also being the region's uh, technology test and teach branch, uh, which is a lot, of course. And uh, most importantly, she puts the clients and needs first. Uh, that is in her DNA. And um, we appreciate Liz. Thank you, Liz. Hello, this is Bruce Young, FA in Claremont. And today I have the pleasure of giving a shout out to my favorite BOA, Rachel Stewart. Not only are her numbers of 86% deeply served with the CEI of 427 impressive, but she's also had two FA referrals for the firm this year. And she represents her peers on the Culture of Compliance Group. But she's much more than that to me. She is proactive, not only with me, but with the, her peers, and most importantly, with our clients. It's in her nature to be caring and interested in the people's lives, and it shows, and they so much appreciate it. So Rachel, thanks for a great 12 years. You deserve everything that's coming to you. Take care. The next achievement award is the Jim Heron Achievement. This is awarded to production levels between $800,000 and a million dollars a year. And it's my privilege to present that to Michelle Ouellette. Michelle has been a mentor to me since I started, as well as a friend. Michelle had a great 2020. Her gross production for the year was $857,000. She not only did that, she also brought in over $12 million worth of assets and while keeping a deeply served rating of 78%, and as well as that, also had a best month ever in 2020. So my congratulations to Michelle Ouellette. Well done, Michelle. Hi, Carol. I wanna say congratulations on getting the Jim Herod Award for over 800,000 production. That's wonderful. I definitely could not run that office without you. You definitely take care of me and that office and all the clients, so I appreciate it very much. So I also want to say thank you for over 20 years at Edward Jones and over eight of them have been with me and I couldn't imagine anybody else in your chair. So congratulations and I hope you enjoy your day. My name is Brian Musselman. Most of you know me as AKA the FA that stole part of Alan Holmes business. But what most people don't realize, what I really stole or the most biggest treasure I got was having Stacy Smith as my BOA. Um, by far, she has helped out tremendously and is really an asset to me. I'd like to tell you a little bit about her awards. They're hard for me to remember, so I've got to really read them off. Um, 2007 started as the BOA Managing Partner Conference, which was the initial one. She managed to get the, from 2015 to 2018, the Client Service Award for the top 25 producers. 2012, 2013, she was invited to the Drucker Conference. 2018, she won the Jim Harold Achievement Award, and the following year, 2019, she won the Frank Finnegan Achievement Award. 2020, she also got the Spirit or Partnership Award. Let's just put it this way, she's been to St. Louis so many times, the social actually named a drink after her. Um, so I really appreciate everything she does. Honestly, if I succeed at this, it is directly related to what Stacy brings, her professionalism, her knowledge and her personal service. And if I don't succeed at this, I'm taking her with me. <laughs> anyway, uh, love you, Stacy. I really appreciate you, um, everything, and I'm so glad to have you as my VOA. Take care. My good buddy, Alberta Bonfield, is celebrating 15 years with Edward Jones. That's 15 years of providing great service to his clients. And last year was no different. He leads our region and deeply served at 95%. And he has a CEI score of 439, which puts him in the top 25% for client service excellence for the whole firm. Last year, he brought in 13 new households, totaling almost 13 million in new assets. Do the math on that. And he earned the Jack Thielen Production Award with gross commissions of $512,000, all while completing a good night. Great job, Alberto. Ryan. First, I want to say thank you for recruiting me to this amazing firm seven years ago. Because you believed in me, you changed my life and my family's life. So first, I say thank you for that. Buckminster Fuller famously said that integrity is the essence of everything successful. Thank you for being a man of integrity. 
and because of that, you built a successful business. You qualified for the Jack Thielen Award, and with that, you grew your gross revenue from 2019 to 2020 by over $80,000, and you brought in $7.5 million in new assets. Thank you for serving your clients so well.